My name is Rose Gang. I came from Jos Plateau State. I want to give God the glory for all he has done for me. I don't know how to start because the testimonies are too much. I, how I came here, it was a great testimony. You see, I am not a member of this commission. My boss actually brought me to this place. I was sick for one year. And I've been having pause for that one year. Pause has been coming out. And God granted me favor from my boss. Even from that one year, from the hospital bill, he took care of it. I think I need to come in here, give the background of this. What caused the pause? Then you continue from there. Our sister had what they call intestinal blockage. So they did a major surgery on her to remove whatever blocked the intestine. And when they did that surgery, instead of the wound to heal, it began to build up pus. They had to perform four more surgery on her to remove the pus. When I spoke to her boss, I brought her. When they did the, when they did the first surgery, when they did the first surgery, they told her that she had three days to last. And at the end of the first surgery, the pus was still coming out. Our boss said, let me fly her abroad. Three professors that are, spe that, was, that are specialists in that situation called the boss aside and said, do not waste your money. She doesn't have more than five days to leave. The boss said, please, I am bringing her of this hospital and I'm bringing her to church. The boss placed a, a call to our, our father in the Lord who said, bring her to heal and deliverance. She was here. And the pulse, her tummy was full of pulse with mighty pain. But when the praise and worship was on, what kept coming from the altar? The pulse that could not come out on its own busted. The place busted and pulse began to spill out, spill out, stained all her dress and blood came out afterwards. They had to carry her to the women's section. It was our sister there that washed her clothes and all the things she wore to, for the pulse that, they, that was stained by the pulse and blood. Brethren, the pain died instantly. The pulse all came out. Before, she wouldn't be able to stand. Talk about wearing high heel. That was the end of the, that pain. That now, when our father and the Lord met her, nobody told our father and the Lord that the situation was a poor situation. But when he was praying for her, he kicked her feet and said, dry up, you devil, dry up, you demon, dry up, demon, dry up. How the servant of the Lord knew that it was something that needed to be dry up, only him and the God that called our father knew. But our sister is here to declare all the glory back to the Almighty for that mighty miracle. Even you who attempted to summarize the testimony, I think it was over summarized. You had intestinal obstruction and they tried to evacuate whatever it was and then it got complicated. What were the complications? The complications were that the, it started building a pus, there was infection and the pus was just coming. They had to go back for another surgery. That, that was the only way they can evacuate. So they the did the surgery twice? Three times. After the yes, first after, surgery, yes. they did a, 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 a corrective surgery yes, three more yes, times. Yes, and it's so clear. they cut you four it's times. Bad. You need to see that my stomach right now. It's not a good side. The abdomen is not a good side. Yes, yes. By various scars. And then the pus accumulated. Now they, they said they gave you how many days? They gave me the first one was five days. To leave. To leave. Now, the, now when the doctor said we give you five days, he's, he's talking about the scientific progression of the disease as he knows. That if this is what is there, then under normal circumstances, within the next few days, it will reach its conclusion. Pause in the abdomen is an emergency of emergency. There is something that is called peritonitis, and if it is bacterial peritonitis or fecal peritonitis, it means that the whole of the abdomen is inflamed and infected, and then the person can die any moment. That's why they say they gave her five days. And there are times where they open the system 
and had to physically wash what the, the viscera, wash the abdominal cavity, that is wash it with antibiotic fluid, wash it. Am I communicating? And she came in that condition, I remember where she sat, up there. Tuesday, which Tuesday was that? Last week, Tuesday. Just last Tuesday. Yes, when you asked us to put our... That is what is important for us. We almost missed that. Last week, Tuesday. They padded the car that was coming with they the pillows. They padded the car with pillows. Yes, when I was coming. Why? Because I was not... I could not uh, sit down. I don't have the strength to, to withstand the journey from Joss to Abuja. Because my boss said I, I, have to, I have to come down. My money, I was like, Rose, can you travel? I said, let's go. I said, because she saw the condition, she was like, Kai, can you travel? I said, no, let's go. This is incredible. This is in. Can we all be on our feet? This is incredible. Is there anyone who witnessed that or who is aware of her case? Come, come, anybody who witnessed it, I want to say something about it. Or he's aware of the case. Just one week. All we are talking about is just last Tuesday. There's no difference. It could have come through there. It's no protocol that is, says it must pass to one place. So on Tuesday, doing the praise and worship, then I saw when the usher was taking her out. She was water was dropping on her body. It was flowing. Flowing, flowing. The, 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 the fluid was flowing from yes, the sir. body. Yes, sir. Saw so her too. When she was, when they were bringing her to church, she was very tired. She couldn't even walk. They held her. They, they held brought, her when they brought her to yes, church sir. last she week. She was Tuesday. very tired, very weak. I said, God, touch this lady today. Yes, I saw when Daddy was praying to her. The priest was sitting and was where she was. You were there. Yes. I saw her when Daddy prayed for her. You saw her? Yes, sir. Yes, I'm a manager in Joss. We came together with you the You are her manager in Joss? Yes, sir. You came with her? Yes, yes. We had to charter a car because she, was in, she has been vomiting for 24 hours. So we pulled her from the hospital. She was even having drip. They had to discharge the drip and we brought her with pillows. We took, I think we spent almost seven, eight hours from just this place because she was so weak, very pale. So when we came, we sat down here. It was when daddy was talking about that. After the count of seven, hallelujah. Something will start coming out of our body. Yeah, our body immediately she started the seven hallelujah. The post started came, coming out. The this post was started the same coming post out. that in the night she could not sleep. Her mother tried to water, water. The pouring water. like water. Yes, sir. At night, the, the post was disturbing her. Her mom tried to pull it out. We press it in the night. The post did not come out. But at the call, uh, the seven hallelujah, the post started co coming out like water. Then the next is blood. They had to carry out outside. Uh, outside. Incredible. You are the ones who attended to her in the toilet. Naked. You watch. Yes. Daddy. On this and, and, and skirt and everything. Daddy, you, 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 somebody needs to see the abdomen. The way deep. In fact, very deep. Very deep. In fact, the wound was open. I, so I'm not the one that opened you up. I'm the one that opened her up. Daddy, you see the kind thing coming out from her body. I am the one that washed the skirt, the paint, everything. Daddy, you need to see it. The odor alone. Odor alone. Alone. Daddy. Thank you. God bless you. You saw such affliction, such odor, and such everything, and you use your hand to still wash the underwears and wash everything. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless you. Is that is a mother. Yes. Praise the Lord. It is a wonderful thing. Frankly, what she said, favor followed her because her, her boss told us to come. We came. I said to her, I don't know whether she will be able to come to, uh, to Abuja because of the situation, because of the condition. As we came, and we met the boss, and he came. It was just a favor. It's just a favor. Because when she has been working with that man, oh my God, since then, her salary, everything has been given to her. Everything. 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 You must have spent so much I'm money on this you, case. I, everything. Eh? Over three million. And my boss spent it. And your organization, your boss paid it. Yes. Over three million. 
is how she's walking. No, I'm the one that jacked her up. I said, stand up. You are in the right place. The are we seeing a miracle or not? Flushing. If you see the post like tap, like when you untap. It was flowing like tap. I know because my eyes is like this. Who was that like this? He was holding like this. Can we lift our hands to the King of Kings in the mouth of two or three, all of you that have testi testified to this testimony, God will give you your own testimony. Can you step down here? Step down here. All of you step down here. Hold your hand together. Lift it up. No new person should join. Lift your hands up. Hold the hands together, lift it up now. Father, grant them their testimonies. In the name of Jesus, the way you stood to testify to this intervention, people will stand by you. One, two, three, power! Power! Receive! Receive your miracle. Receive your testimony. Receive your tolerance. Somebody is under power in the crowd over there. Receive your testimony. Receive your turnaround. Receive your visitation. I prophesy upon the crowd today every demonic siege on your life, every demonic agenda in your life is hereby arrested. My God, I your God, give you your testimony, grant you your testimony, cause your miracle to happen in the name of Jesus. I don't, I'm, I don't even know what to do right now, whether it's explosive praise or I think this one is, is worship. Lift your hands and let's appreciate him. Praise and give you glory. We praise and honor you. We praise and give you glory. We praise and honor you. We praise and give you glory. Oh Lord, we praise and She started jogging 
the next day. If she was healed on Tuesday, she started jogging on Wednesday. That the doctor said, when he said, I want to go to church, he said, go, go, go. This is your case, need prayer. That is, we don't know what else to do. Go, go. This one need prayer. What a mighty God. Father, we are, we are, we are appreciative. We can't thank you enough. They had spent, according to our over three million. Question is, how much did they spend here before they were healed? Zero. How much did you pay for card? You know, people possessed with devils say that church exists for money. This is not a money, this is a case of life and death. Somebody giving time to die, rescued by the power of God without charge. When the mind of people is evil, they think evil about everything. To the perverse, everything is perverse. To the corrupt, everything is corrupt. They can't imagine. That since in their mind everything is all about money, that someone can function free of charge. We have never charged one person one dime from the healing of blind eyes to cancer to everything. Freely you have received. Freely give. And in most of those services, we even forget to take the offering. Am I communicating? That is a merciful God we serve that has done a thing like this. Lift your hands and give him the praise. Mm -hmm. The light of the Lord you step down into darkness. Open my eyes, let me see you did not make this heart out of you.
Lift your hands high. Worship. Here I am to worship. Here I am to die. Here I am to say. Together, wonderful! 
Lift up your two hands where you are. Jesus is here. You whisper that name, Jesus. Again. Showed us the clip of last week Tuesday with the abdominal place there, the IV line, the cannula on the hand. So far, we thank God. See the face is also very ash pale, somewhat. There is full blood circulation if you can see her face right now. Lift up your hands and let's appreciate it.
this attitude of worship and this presence, I'd like to encourage you to read your seeds of destiny when you get back home. But understand that for everyone we reach out to, everyone we reach out to, we've reached out to not just a soul but a generation. Lift up your hands as we continue in that attitude of worship. We'll be receiving Dunami's voice to this morning. They'll be taking us through one of the very many songs that God has given to his servant, the senior pastor. And I believe that as a singer minister, you will be blessed. <laughs>
Testimonies already preached. All I can feel in the house is called the love of God. 
how loving God is. By way of a charge, I want to to reason with you on the power of God's love. power of his law. Second Timothy chapter 1 verse 7 He said for God has not given us the spirit of fear but of power of love And of a sound mind. The love of God is the basis of the power of God. The Spirit of God is the Spirit of love, and it is the Spirit of power. God uses power to enforce love. When a man's child fell into a pit, God forbid, not a, a destructive pit, or runs to the highway and is risking his life, and the father dives to pull him out or dashes to the road to retrieve him from an oncoming vehicle. That wasn't a show of power. He was not trying to show that he can run. He was not trying to show that he has power. That was a show of love. God uses power to enforce law. That was why all the lepers and the blind people who met him, they did not say, thou son of David, show power on us. Thou son of David, show that you are powerful with us. What will they ask? Thou son of David, do what? Mercy, which is the communication of love. What I saw in that lady's testimony is called the power of God's love. Took them seven hours for a journey of about maybe four hours because of bad road. Otherwise, it would have been three hours. Seven hours to come. With operations haven't been done four times. She said her abdomen is not a sight to behold. With pause. Just one encounter with the master, he demonstrated not power, but love. What is the power of the love of God? First, the love of God handles what the effort, resources, and wisdom of man can't handle. 